The city of Oxnard is studying sewage to better understand the COVID virus. News Channel reporter Senator De Los Santos explains through testing, two mutations have already been found. It's here at the sewer treatment facility in Oxnard that nearly 20 million gallons of human waste is processed, treated and released into the ocean. And now it's also where COVID testing is taking place. Ever since we've been dealing with this pandemic, we've been looking for innovative ways to, um, to understand more about the virus, understand its spread, and hopefully come up with ways to uh, help protect our residents. Oxnard Fire Chief Alex Hamilton started a weekly wastewater study. Our facility here takes samples of, of the wastewater as it comes into the facility. They just uh, uh, pull a little of that sample out for us to send to our lab in Colorado uh, for COVID testing. Just last week, test results came back showing the United Kingdom variant is likely in Oxnard. The first time we tested for it, one of those two uh, mutations was present, but not the second one. Um, and then the second test we did the following week, both, both mutations were present, which would indicate that it's, uh, it's likely the UK variant. This is concerning because of the increased transmissibility. It is not more deadly. More studies are underway to confirm if it is the UK strain. In the meantime, these findings provide critical information. We saw a, an immediate spike right around Thanksgiving and Christmas, and so that allowed us to do some forward planning with St. John's Regional Medical Center so that we could start uh, making plans for what we knew was coming. And in the next few weeks, that we'll also be able to test for the South African variant. In Oxnard, I'm News Channel reporter Senere De Los Santos.